Right now, we are bringing you an update to a story our friend Leon Bibb first brought us last year. Archaeologists from the Cleveland Museum of Natural History have uncovered 4,000-year-old clay floors in Sheffield Village. Our Meg Shaw went to the dig site in Lorain County today. And Meg, this isn't the first time the team has dug in that area, right? Yeah, they actually started in 2008 and then went back to the same site last summer. That's when they first discovered the floors. But at the time, they didn't know what they were. No one's ever encountered anything like that in northern Ohio, that type of construction. It's taken three digs over eight years, but they finally found these yellow clay floors. There's actually several levels in this. In Sheffield Village near the Burl Homestead. Dr. Brian Rudman, a curator from the museum, told me they now believe the floors were part of an Indian settlement from 4,000 years ago. It's extremely rewarding, uh, particularly this season, because we're able to learn a, a, a lot more about the prehistory of Ohio. Team members told me they're beginning to think several families lived here, almost like a village. This site really changes our thinking about how permanent some of the groups were. The diggers are making new discoveries every day out here at the excavation site with every dig of the shovel. It looks like a few more pieces of the deer skeleton. During my time at the site today, an intern from the museum actually found a deer jaw with its teeth still intact. Take it back to the lab and we'll let it dry out. It's, it's fun and interesting to go dig in you know, other countries or other states, but it's important to know our, history, our prehistory, where we are from. John Hunter, the mayor of Sheffield Village, spent some time at the site today. He told me these artifacts are extremely important to Northeast Ohio. Uh, we don't want to forget about where we came from. And the team told me they plan to make a few more digs at the site this summer before they wrap up for the season. And now they're already looking forward to discovering more next year.